Thailand has some pretty strict laws when it comes to insulting its royalty. In particular, the king of Thailand, you're not allowed to say anything negative about him because if you do, you could face some jail time. Well, interestingly enough, someone who is critical of the king in Thailand decided to post a video that went viral on Facebook featuring him wearing a crop top and shopping with tattoos and everything showing in Munich. Those okay. are fake tattoos, right? No, they're real tattoos. Really? I think he, for some reason, lied and said that they're fake tattoos, but I think they're real tattoos. The the New York Times has reported that they're real tattoos, but who wow. knows? Who knows and who cares? Yeah, it's okay? irrelevant. It's funny that he would, if they are real tattoos, it's funny that he would lie and say that they're fake tattoos as if that would make it better. I would argue that would make it worse. Like you went out of your way for to anyway, moving on. So he's embarrassed because he's wearing a crop top. He's shopping in a crop top, but he should just own up to it because you like the crop top, you like the midsection, you're feeling good about yourself, you're shopping in Munich, you're the freaking king of Thailand, just own it, right? But no, he got all hurt about it and started crying about it. And then they contacted Facebook and said, you must take this viral video down or else we're gonna go after you, we're gonna sue you. So Thailand's laws make insulting the monarchy a crime punishable by up to 15 years in prison. And guess what? Facebook listened to them and they took the video down. They didn't take the video down, but it is blocked in Thailand. So anyone living in Thailand, anyone existing in Thailand won't have access to it. But we have access to it. We have access to the screenshots, which we've shown you. And it's just a lot of fun. It's a lot yeah. of fun. <sighs> okay, so maybe we shouldn't have kings. Because maybe they do absurd things like, hey, if anybody even insults me, mm -hmm. I'm gonna put you in jail for 15 years. I know, I know, bro, but you're wearing a freaking crop top in Munich, you're out in public wearing that. You know what I'm saying? It's not like he did this in the privacy of his own home and then someone invaded his privacy and then obtained images of him. Like he wore it out in public because he felt pretty damn good about it. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So just own up to it. There's nothing wrong with it. And what's the point of being king if you can't go around on a crop top? Right? I mean, isn't the whole point of being king is that you're awesome, you rule the place, and you can do anything you want. So instead, you're hiding whatever your real identity is. I don't know, right? Like, whatever it is, you're just having fun, right? Mm -hmm. And and instead, you're going around, and you know that's why it's like, look, is it better to be a king than it is to be uh, someone with no money? Of course. On the other hand, it's not that great, man. You live in this little cage where everything is judged nonstop. You think like the royalty in, in the UK, I wouldn't want it at all. Mm -hmm. You can say I'm crazy, I don't care, that's fine. I don't wanna live that life where they're all constantly under a microscope and they have to follow all the stupid, stupid etiquette about when to bow, and when to have tea, and when to do this and that, yeah. et cetera. And they can't live their lives free. I, I don't, that's why Prince Charles, I, I don't begrudge the guy getting into whoever's tampons that he got into. <laughs> it was a fun recorded tape that got leaked of him. Anyway, so- Wait, what? Yeah, he said he wanted to be his lover's tampon. It was gross, but it was, but the guy loved her. He loved her, okay? So anyways, long story. You can love people in other ways. I hear you, I hear you, sister. That is very fair. Anyway. He's a uh, cyclist. <laughs> 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 anyway, moving on. <laughs> okay, the main part of this is, guys, Thailand, get rid of the nonsense monarchy. And I'm not just picking on Thailand here. Everybody that's got a monarchy, yes, including the UK. What I are you holding on to? Not just antiquated notions, but notions that were dictatorial and wrong and authoritarian well, and stupid. They don't, they shouldn't rule over us. Why should we hand our freedom over to kings? Now, I know you've got a parliamentary system now. But look, in Thailand, still 15 years. In the UK, people will get pissed about this. <gasps> How dare you, God save the queen, right? Who, what century are you in? Get over it already, get over it and all this nonsense. What are we playing, Game of Thrones? What are we playing, silly little games here, princesses and princesses? It's absolute madness. Yeah, I don't know. I just, I feel like if you are a person in power, and you show the world that you're this easily insulted, that people can get under your skin this much, you don't come across as a powerful person. Yeah, and guess what? These All of these so-called kings and queens, at some point, one of their ancestors butchered everyone else in the country and took power, right? So that's how you get to be a king or a queen. And then all of them since then have been riding off of that. You think they're special? 
No, they're spoiled little brats that never had to do anything their whole lives, had all this money handed to them. So you think they could lead countries? Mm -hmm. They're usually pathetic guys like this riding around in crop tops. And then when they get caught, they go, oh, no, you insulted me. Put him in prison, put him in prison, he insulted me. You yeah. know what that says? It shows you're incredibly weak. That's what you are. And all these, whether it's the kings or it's the uh, the the presidents uh, pretending to be in a democracy who put people in prison for offending them, um, it's our wannabe authoritarian leader here in America, Donald Trump, mm -hmm. who just we just found out the other day told James Comey, "Hey, why can't you just imprison the reporters who report the leaks about me?" Oh, they're being so mean to me. He don't like that. Yeah. Or by the way, it's the religions. Oh, you offended me because you drew Muhammad, so I want you in prison or I want you dead. You offended me because you did something about Jesus Christ, and so I'm gonna do this and that. And say, hey, if you're so right and you're so strong, why are you so thin-skinned? You should be able to take all criticism and not have any issue. You should have the great security of knowing that you are right. But in reality, you know you're not right and you know that you didn't earn anything to become king in this case. Just let it go, man. You should voluntarily let it go. Just be like, you know what, guys, you're right. I'm not a king. What the hell did I do? I, I just know. I want to wear crop tops in Munich. Yeah, I just want to run around <laughs> Munich going schloop and das, das ist Vitamin. If you're a member of the Young Turks, you not only get the whole two hour Young Turks show on demand anytime you want, ad free, but you also get so many other shows. Old school, you'll love it. Aggressive progressive for guys who are true progressives. Now also Nerd Alert for gaming and tech. What the flick for movie reviews. You will love it. Check it out right now at tytnetwork.com slash join.